All right, ladies and gentlemen, this is my exciting day. My uh, big kayak came in today. This is my RA220 Brooklyn Kayak Company. Came all bubble wrap nice. Uh, it's looking good. I'm gonna take it apart, all the wrapping off of it, and then uh, we'll go from there. And ain't she a beauty, look at this. Wow, it's got a rudder on the back with the uh, cables that hook to that. And they go all the way up to the front pedals. You can steer it that way when you're paddling. It keeps it on track. Place for a five-gallon bucket. Plenty of storage here. The camera doesn't do it any justice. This thing looks a lot bigger than what you're seeing on here. Plenty of space behind the seat. Nice seat. Clips in down here. It's got rings to hook it in. We got storage right here, storage in front of the seat. It's bigger than it looks on this camera. It's nice. And uh, these come out. You got through haul storage. You could throw a pup tent in there, sleeping bag, whatever you need, stove. If you want to do a little camping, comes with a rod holder right here. Swivel one, nice. And it mounts right up here. And then rod holders right here really sweet and then we have rails here you can put your yak attack uh, mounts with your fish finders whatever you want to add as accessories these here i'm not sure i think that's you can put uh maybe stabilizers out here if you want to make it more stable pontoon stabilizers or it could be for anything else to mount on there up here we've got another storage hatch look at the size of that one yeah, that's that's nice same thing comes out through haul you sit down in has a rubber seal around here she goes in nice and tight seal that off in case i take one over the bow here's a drain plug in case you didn't manage to get any water seepage inside the hall you can open it up and tip her up and drain her out or unplug it air it out moisture build in handle here and over here and it came with uh paddles too there's a set of paddles and you can clip them in right here you have these little your handles but you take paddle stick in there and pull that right over either side you can do that Here's some extra rings here. I'm not exactly sure what you use them for. I suppose, heck, you could, if you want to put an anchor off the side, you could. Um, yeah, adjustable pedals. You have these here. This controls your uh, your rudder. You have, so it's a, a dual purpose. Here's your foot rest, and then you just tip your toes forward, and you can, and you can, uh, steer with this so i'm just gonna have to get that all set up here in a little while and see how that goes you pull this here to bring your rudder up or down i gotta hook all the ropes up so there we go there you have it the brooklyn kayak company this came all the way from new jersey made right here in the united states She's a beauty, 11 and a half feet long. She's 34 inches wide, which is wider than my other kayaks. This is like a 30. That one's a 30 over there. This is 34, so it's a little more stable. It's got a flatter bottom, but it has a V on the uh, stern. So if you ever did take a, a pretty good size wave come up, she'll cut right through and then lift over it. And it's got a nice, uh, v cut on the front and it looks pretty stable i've seen uh films where people were standing up in this and fishing i don't know about me standing up in a little boat i didn't like standing up in a 12 footer too much but anyways that's what they claim and uh there you have it the brooklyn ra220 11 and a half foot fishing machine kayak 
hopefully I can get this out on uh, maybe Lake Michigan, Lake Erie, when it's not a rough day. But they'll take more than you will realize if you know what you're doing on these things. You can head straight in, and I've seen them cut right through surf coming over the top of them and paddle right through till they get out to the calmer water. They launch them right from shores. And there it is, the Brooklyn Kayak.